Uh, yes, actually, I did graduate from college on the dean's list. I just went for a two-year medical administration program. Um, this is me in Roman on my uh, graduation day. This is me accepting an award for my high academic honors. <laughs> But yeah, um, I did. I graduated the two-year program, um, and I did it without taking any math classes. I somehow um, tested out of math. I have no clue how because uh, when I went into college, I was on a seventh grade math level um, after being at a behavioral school for high school. Totally no hate to the behavioral school I went to, but you know, when you're trying to stop kids from like climbing up towers and like jumping each other, you know, math is not a huge priority. <laughs> Interestingly, I graduated in 2015, so that was what, not 10 years ago, but around that long ago. And I had like uh, visible tattoos, not as much as I do now, definitely, um, but I did have some visible tattoos and um, I personally then did not see a lot of uh, women with like hand tattoos, like uh, chest tattoos, stuff like that. Now it's very common, um, but I don't, when I got tattooed as a woman like that, I don't remember it being as common. And I could not get placed into an internship in the medical field um, because of my tattoos. But I still somehow graduated. The thing is, though, is I went to look for positions after I graduated, and I would have made less, um, you know, being a medical office assistant um, than I was making, you know, with my own business that I had at the time, which I still have. So instead, um, I just picked up more clients with my job because usually I do like, uh, they call it consulting. It's, I don't really think it is. Um, and I actually started transcribing death records. Well, medical records, but a big portion of them were death records. That was a wild job. I mean, it was sad, but it was also like shocking. And it was, I definitely couldn't do it now. Like it would give me too much anxiety. I don't know how I did it. But having that, um, you know, diploma or whatever definitely helped. But yeah, a lot of people like, um, you know, <laughs> a lot of people when they ask me about my background, they'll be like, did you graduate high school? And I'll say, yeah, um, I am a college graduate. I graduated college. And they're like, oh, that's so good for you because <laughs> they, they would never think that. And I'm totally not downing anybody that doesn't have a high school diploma, doesn't have a GED, whatever, because in my opinion, like trade work right now, whoo. You don't really honestly need to have those things, in my opinion, to really move forward in the world, not from what I've seen lately anyways. And it's certainly not a reflection of somebody's, you know, intelligence or character. But yes, I have gone to college, I graduated, high honors, very proud of that.